Hello, today we're going to uncover one of nature's most intriguing questions. Why is the sky blue? It's a query that's puzzled many of us since childhood. And today, we're diving deep into the world of science to demystify this captivating phenomenon. To understand why the sky appears blue, we need to start with a fundamental principle of physics. Scattering, or atmosphere, is composed of tiny molecules like oxygen and nitrogen, which scatter sunlight as it travels through. Sunlight is made up of different colors, each with its own wavelength. When sunlight passes through the atmosphere, shorter wavelengths like blue and violet are scattered more than longer wavelengths like red and orange. This scattering of shorter wavelengths is the primary reason we see blue when we look at the sky. Now let's delve deeper into a concept called Rayleigh scattering. This phenomenon, named after British scientist Lord Rayleigh, explains why shorter wavelengths are scattered more than longer ones. The size of the scattering particles in the atmosphere is crucial. Since blue light has a shorter wavelength, it's scattered in all directions, more effectively by the smaller air molecules, creating that iconic blue hue we see above us. Why isn't the sky blue all the time? Great question. During sunrise and sunset, the sky takes on breathtaking shades of red, orange, and pink. This happens because as the sun gets lower in the sky, its light has to pass through a thicker layer of the atmosphere. This increased thickness scatters more of the shorter wavelengths, allowing the longer wavelengths in orange and pink to dominate the sky's color palette, creating those stunning twilight hues. Have you ever noticed that the sky's color can vary based on the weather or location? On clear days, the sky often appears a vibrant blue, while on overcast days, it might seem more pale or gray. This variation is due to factors like humidity, pollution, and the size of particles in the atmosphere. When the atmosphere contains more water vapor or pollution, it can scatter sunlight differently, affecting the color of the sky Interestingly, the color of the sky can also be influenced by the environment around us. If you've ever been to a coastal area with a clear ocean view, you might have noticed that the sky seems even bluer. This phenomenon, known as the blue ocean effect, sure, because the ocean reflects the blue color of the sky back into our line of sight, intensifying the blue perception. The way we perceive the color of the sky is not just a scientific curiosity. It also has psychological implications. Studies have shown that the color blue has a calming effect on our minds, contributing to a sense of tranquility and relaxation. This might explain why gazing up at a clear blue sky often leaves us feeling refreshed and at ease. And there you have it, the captivating science behind why the sky is blue. It's a mesmerizing interplay of sunlight, atmospheric particles, and the intricate processes of scattering. From the enchanting blue hues to the striking colors of sunsets, the sky never ceases to amaze us with its natural beauty and scientific wonders. Remember to hit that like button if you found this exploration into the science of the sky fascinating. If you have any more questions or topics you'd like us to explore, be sure to leave a comment below. Don't forget to subscribe and ring the notification bell so you never miss an enlightening video. Until next time, keep your eyes on the sky and keep wondering.